welcome back. We've got another workout for you. Everything can be done in quarantine, so all you need is a chair, heavy backpack, and something you can grip onto that's also light. I've got a can of beans, you can go tennis ball, something like that. Okay, so we're gonna go three exercises, three times, twice. So there's six different exercises in total. We'll see what I need in a sec. First three exercises we're gonna roll through is seated jumps. So we're gonna start off with a bit of power. So all I want you to do, touch your butt on the edge of the seat here, and then just gonna launch yourself up as high as you can. And then when you land, you wanna land really soft, making sure those knees don't buckle in. So land, knees out, super soft, okay. As you're doing this, the leg is on the floor, you want to think about squeezing that butt cheek, really grinding that foot into the floor as you press. And you don't want to let that chest stop coming out, you don't want to start letting that, you want to hold that in nice and tight. Pressing over the crown of your head, punching up to the ceiling. Beautiful, 10 of those, each arm. Okay, third exercise in the first round, suitcase carry. So, what you're going to do, is you might want a heavier backpack for this. But all you're gonna do is just hold it by your side, okay? So that bag is gonna be pulling you down to the ground this way. You have to resist that. Hold yourself nice and strong here using your obliques. So all you're gonna do is from here, just holding that backpack, holding up nice and straight, big chest. Just gonna walk with it if you've got space. So if you don't have space, just march in place, okay? So I would time this, go 30 seconds each side, and then switch sides, same thing the other side, even yourself out. Okay. That's a core exercise. Okay, that's the first round. We're gonna go through that three times, and then we're gonna come to the next round. So once you've done your first three rounds of those three exercises, next three, we're gonna go on to single leg chair squat. So, Five each side of these. For a lot of you, this might be quite difficult. So if it's too hard for you, all you're gonna do for a beginner stage is you're gonna push your arms forward and you're just gonna lower yourself onto the chair. Let's stand back up again. Same thing. Okay. If you think you're pretty strong, then you're gonna go to the chair, stand back up again. Okay. If you think you're really strong, then Add a backpack, and like we did with the press out squats before, pull the backpack apart, press it out, and you go down, that's your mark. Okay, so only five each leg of those. The next one's gonna be where you need your can of beans or your tennis ball, something light, and something you can get your grip around. So you're gonna land on the floor, make sure you clean your floor, so one arm, you're just gonna rest your forehead on that arm. Other arm, you're gonna grip the can or tennis ball. And basically, you wanna push your elbow and your forearm up to the ceiling and then overhead. So you're squeezing the can the whole time and you almost wanna be pushing up towards the ceiling and then overhead kind of upwards if you can. If you can't get very far, that's fine. Just pull it up as high as you can. So once you've done, once you've done 10 reps of those, you should really feel it burning in right behind your shoulder blade and in your traps a bit as well. Final exercise in this last bit, 
It's dead bugs, so if you've got a band, stick it around your feet. If you don't, that's fine as well. What you want to do here, grab your backpack, flip it both sides, and you can get it even out of So you're gonna line your back in a dead bug position. What you want to do is rip the backpack apart. Like I said, stick a band around your feet if you've got a mini band lined about. Maybe get some, because during this time, a lot of the workouts, uh, they'll come in, come in handy a lot. So maybe get yourself some mini bands. Exact same thing. Just have a little bit of extra resistance. Pulling that knee. Hit. Beautiful. So you're gonna go through that set three times, and then you know, hallelujah. It's a good workout. Thanks for watching. I think we got some more coming. Might do them every day, every couple of days, but uh, yeah, got nothing else to do really, so <laughs> we'll keep them coming.